Good afternoon, peeps. Uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel, um, Aussie Star Wars Collector. Uh, also, I'm running a Facebook page, as most of you probably know now, Awesome Andy's, or sorry, Andy's Awesome Collectibles. Uh, I'm also affiliated with Holy Grail Collectibles as well, so I know a lot of you are members of the pages, so uh, appreciate your continued support. Um, and I'm coming to you today to show you an unboxing right here of something I've been waiting for uh, for several weeks now to arrive from the States. Um, fantastic item and one of the best condition ones overall that I've seen for a while. So without any further ado, let's get to it. Picked up pretty, pretty well. Get that off there. Put that away before I stab myself or someone else. Move the box to the side a little bit so that I can get it out. Note from my guy. <laughs> I looked after me pretty well with some of the stuff that sent me over the over the journey. Let's get all this pillow wrap off. Get that out of the way. Okay. Uh, putting bags here. I can assure you guys this is not actually from Walmart. But I appreciate the fact He's covered it before wrapping it, so and here it is. Awesome. Chewbacca's Bandolier from Return of the Jedi. Um, this is you can see there still sealed. Both ends. It's never been opened. So yeah, pretty rare to find one of these uh, still sealed. Um, great condition. Overall, the box has got, obviously, some shelf wear signs. But overall, it's in really, really nice condition. It's got the... Um, the back's really nice. You can see a bit of a crease just across here, uh, which is really common with these, although most of the time the crease is a lot severer uh, than this one because a lot of the times when they were packed, uh, it was folded over. So, which, um, when you re-straighten it a few times, continues to... Uh, you know maximize that crease there so this is actually quite a light crease considering which is really nice um it's actually very straight as well but yeah fantastic pop still there as i said still sealed both ends so yeah um this will probably become available i would say um on uh andy's awesome collectibles page crossed with holy grail collectibles as well so yeah i'm just uh not sure at this stage because as i say I've, I've not seen one in this good of a condition overall so i may end up keeping it but if i don't someone out there uh, ian teferi i'm thinking you possibly buddy uh might end up scoring this bad boy so i am getting an acrylic case for it too from uh from Glenn Pluck at uh, Ultimate Figure Protection. So it'll look really, really nice, I think, in, a, in an acrylic case. Once I get it in an acrylic case, who knows, I may just fall in love with it all over again and may end up keeping it anyway. But, yeah. Uh, so anyway, I just thought I'd share this with you guys. It's a really, really nice piece. Still got great vibrant colour. There's no fading or anything like that at all as well. So... Yeah, very stoked to have landed this, so yeah. But anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. Um, remember, hit the subscribe button, the like button. Uh, it helps a lot. And uh, I'll see you all on the next one.